Dairy production in Africa contributes one-fifth of the world's average, with the highest volume skewed towards eastern and northern Africa, according to Food and Agriculture Organization statistics. Though there is a slow overall growth in milk production in Africa, individual countries have registered growth in the recent past. More efforts are needed to achieve complete autonomy of the sector in the continent. Dairy sector has also been envisaged as a means to improve on the nutritional status and income generation for poor families in Africa. These have led to the implementation of many developmental projects to improve the situations. One such project was the Dairy Chain Program, co-financed in the SCPEU Cooperation Program in Higher Education, EduLink 2. A program of the SCP Group of States with financial assistance of the European Union. Dairy Chain Project was designed to strengthen capacity of higher education institutions in Eastern and Western Africa to enhance efficiency in the dairy value chain. The project was located in Kenya, Nigeria and Ghana in collaboration with Obafemi Awolowo, University in Nigeria, University of Education, Winneba in Ghana and Egerton University in Kenya. The key objective of this project was to strengthen the capacity of higher education institutions in Eastern and Western Africa to deliver competent graduates for enhanced competitiveness in the dairy value chain through curricula that are entrepreneurial, gender-sensitive, practical-oriented and relevant to the needs of the labor market and with a focus on poverty reduction. The target groups were the academic staff and post and undergraduate students, enterprises such as smallholder farmers, processors, traders, cooperatives, extension services, policy makers and consumers of dairy products. Dairy Chain contributed to national and regional policies to advance dairy development in Kenya, Nigeria and Ghana. The project established an inter-institutional network between higher education institutions in Africa and Europe. Interdisciplinary research and academic partnership was also fostered to help in the development of expert knowledge on the dairy value chain. Qualification of academic staff to review, develop and maintain curricula and integrate competence and outcome-based learning was upgraded with some of the staff engaged to develop such curricula for the technical and vocational training institutes in Kenya. Dairy Chain Project was jointly coordinated, successfully implemented and evaluated.